basketball right now, the precaution is limiting the number of visitors in Intermountain facilities like the Utah Valley Hospital behind me. And as of Monday, the limitation is two visitors per patient at a time. The change was made on Monday based on the Utah Department of Health and Centers for Disease Control national guidelines. The new restriction also says that nobody under the age of 18 is advised to visit an Intermountain facility. I, when I found out, I was bawling all night. According to the CDC, fewer people in and out of hospitals helps reduce the chance of catching and spreading illness. Even though the change was made to help people stay healthy, it's a little disappointing for patients like Michaela Iverson. So I am almost 37 weeks pregnant, so the baby could come literally any day. And <laughs> we just found out a few days ago that our daughter, that is two and a half, will not be allowed to visit. But leaving her daughter in the care of someone else while they're in the hospital has its own risks. Uh, other children that could be sick and get our daughter sick and we can't have that around a new baby. Even though children are not at high risk for coronavirus right now, they can still be carriers. So it's important to keep them clean and if they're sick, keep them at home. Something you can always do is wipe down their toys. If they're playing with other children, make sure you keep their stuff and their hands clean. And of course, always make sure to wash your own hands, sanitize at every opportunity. Darren Cowley, Intermountain's Media Relations Director, reminds the public that if you think you have coronavirus, don't simply show up at a clinic or hospital. Cowley says if you have a fever, cough, shortness of breath, or other cold-like symptoms, you can be screened and given a virtual assessment at intermountainconnectcare.org. Intermountain's new restriction includes all Intermountain hospitals, clinics, and Instacares in Utah and Idaho. If you do feel like you're having coronavirus-like symptoms, Intermountain Healthcare does have a call-in line that will answer all your health questions. Reporting in Provo, I'm Kim Peterson. Back to you.